I put this picture up there. I said, caption this or meme, make a meme out of it. Oh so that was the picture that he put up, and he says, the inspiration for that scene in The Hitcher where Rudger Hauer is in the station wagon with the family he eventually kills. And then he made this meme. Okay. <laughs> Somehow that's what you came up with. Please explain yourself, Elliot the Intern. That was just the first thing that I thought of when I saw your picture. It reminded me of that scene in the movie. Good enough. Ever try to go with your second or third thought? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, me, me, mer. Me, me, won't you make a meme out of me? Our caption is... Yes, man. So... Yeah, I put a picture up on my, my Facebook page, the one that people are watching right now. I put it up about a week ago, like right after I lost my residual check, and I thought, we've got to think of a new segment. Oh, yeah. Get away from that, Get away from that expensive one. <laughs> and uh, I put this picture up. And, it, and let me just say, I've had this picture in my phone for a, a minute. My good friend Chalk Wetmore sent this to me randomly. I have no idea what's going on in here. I don't remember this. And uh, when he sent it to me, I was like, I will never, ever show this picture on account of how embarrassing it is. Why? What, what's embarrassing about it? Red, bold haircut, howdy doody, freckly face, big ass buck teeth. <laughs> and I'm going, Guy! you know, I look he just a little... exactly like how I feel when people call me names for being a redheaded ginger. That, that's how I feel like I look. Yeah. All the time. But I, I'm humble, and uh, the show, it's all about being funny, and that is a funny-looking picture. It is. Uh, <laughs> so the thought, first thing that stands out to me is the teeth, of course. Yeah. They're big, or they wouldn't. No, they're not they're wooden. wooden. Those are your teeth. What, is wood ivory to you? <laughs> look, look how white those teeth are. That's not those a retainer, are, right? No, those are or real. A, uh, those are mouthpiece with the, the teeth. Adult the, permanent teeth. Okay. I think those I just, are not baby teeth. No, not baby teeth. Okay. Now, the one to the left of it might be a baby tooth. There's a gap there. A little bit of gap. Did you have braces? Yeah, I did braces. after this. Yeah. This is before braces, obviously. I'm not even sure what year this is. I don't know what, how old I am. You got a little bit of opie look to you as well. I got a lot of opie look to me. And uh, that's not my dad's truck. I don't know whose truck we're in. Um, and I know that that's Brad Cease to the left. And I know back there's Chalk. And there's a guy in between him. I don't remember his name because he left the neighborhood. Like his family moved away when maybe he was 11 or 12. Yeah. Never heard from him again. And I think that might be uh, his brother or his sister behind me. Anyway, I put this picture up there. I said, caption this or meme, make a meme out of it. And boy, did you. Over 470 comments, 11 people shared it. It reached about uh, 44,300 people. Nice. And uh, I'm just going to read you some of my favorite comments. And uh, so what, what would you say about this picture? <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe as you're watching this at home, uh, if you didn't comment on this, now's your chance to leave a comment. How would you caption this picture? What do you think's going on here? Leave me a comment. Maybe uh, one of our interns will, will read one of them. Right, Isaiah? Yep. Right, Elliot? Yes, sir. Okay. All right. I like it. Okay. So here's one uh, by Ray Tull. He said, my cousin do it. <clears throat> Let me do it again. Ray Tull. My cousin doesn't know it yet, but he's holding the porta potty. Long trip, no stopping. So I, maybe that's the jug. Uh, Josh Sweeten says, Uncle Charlie's and his nephew's Boy Scout troop earning their moonshine badge. Like it. I like that. I kind of like that. Moonshine badge. Moonshine badge. Yeah, so this looks like it might be a, a Cub Scout Boy Scout outing because it, it, it looks rednecky. Maybe there would be a moonshine badge if it were in Hickory. So I like that comment. Um, this one got five likes. Dale Lanier. Lanier. L-A-N-I-E-R. He just says, come on in. We're huffing vinegar. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. That's my favorite. I do like, I will tell you, I like short and simple. Yeah. 
Uh, you know, brevity is the soul of wit. So I like it if it's short and concise and very funny. Huff and vinegar. That packed That's a, a punch. One. I got five likes. This one got four likes by Kristen Pollard. <sighs> Some of these hurt. Oh, uh, and it's okay. Hurt your feelings? I mean, a bit? no, no, no. Because I, I'm telling you, this is what I see, and uh, obviously others too okay. see it as well. <laughs> she said, "When Howdy Doody and Ginger Spice have a kid." Oh, yeah. Now I do look like Howdy Doody <laughs> right there. Do you remember Howdy Doody, Elliot? I know you remember Howdy Doody. Oh yes, Isaiah. Howdy Doody. Ever heard of it? I've heard of Howdy Doody. Okay. Howdy Doody. Uh, I don't know why I said it like that. I've heard of Howdy Doody. Howdy Doody. It's Howdy Doody time. <laughs> uh, Mike Norris said, hey, Paul, Aunt B isn't going to make us eat any more of them kerosene cucumbers, is she? Kerosene cucumbers. I like the way it sounded. That got six likes. I like kerosene cucumber. I like the way it sounded. Yep. So that was good, Mike Norris. Shout out. Uh, and this one, oh no, I'll do this one first. This one got seven likes by Christopher Chase Lowry. Where are y'all headed, John? I don't know. Some place called Neverland Ranch. <laughs> that got seven. That's likes. a good one. Now you know about. I know about. I know about okay. that. Yeah. <laughs> it took me a second, but that's, yeah, yeah. that's a good one. That like kind of looks like maybe that's what's yeah. like we're oblivious to the lost uh, boys. The, what's about to happen to yeah. us? <laughs> we have no idea. Now, this one got the most likes. Okay. The next one I'm about to read to you. I can't wait. And it got 24 likes. I'll just read it and I'll give you my opinion later. Okay. <laughs> By Johnny Plata or Plata. I don't know. P L A T A. Johnny Plata. Plata. When uh, we went snipe hunting and I touched my first boner. <laughs> you do look excited. <laughs> we went snipe hunting and I touched my first boner. Is that what it looks like I'm saying? It could. Well, here's, here's what I like about the comment. Uh, this does look like maybe we're going snipe hunting, you know. Um, now, who's – it says I touch my first boner. Now, is he saying I touch my boner? No. Or someone else's someone boner? Someone else's, I believe. That's what you, that's that's what what you got out of that? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Either way, it's false. You're way more excited so, looking as if, as if you touch someone else's as your own. But I would Pretty not excited. be excited <laughs> if I touch someone else's boner. I would be more happy if, I, if it said booby. Oh, uh, yeah. Because I'm a heterosexual male. Understood. Nothing wrong with being the other way. No. But <laughs> I don't know Why you'd be what he excited. meant by it, but a lot of people liked it. Yeah, he, he, he I mean, Winner, winner. He got the most likes, so shout out to him. <laughs> uh, and then some memes were created. You know, because the contest is not just caption this, but also me, 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 yeah. me, 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 me. So people did me, me. And uh, let's, let's look at some of these memes, the Alan Jackson. Um, here's one. It says, woman, say hello to your stepchild, the stepchild. And then that's me. Yep. Yep. That was a good one by uh, Daniel Lamb. All right, let's go to the next one. This one says, beat this lot to it. Got the first pubes. Now, let's dissect this comment. What, what, what do you think he's trying to say here, Stamos? I have no idea. Beat this lot to it. Yeah. Beat this lot to it. Now, I'll, I, don't know. I got my theory. Like uh, Isaiah or Elliot, you want to try and figure out what he means by beat this lot to it? I think the lot refers to the rest of the, the yes. boys in the truck. Yeah. So this is probably someone from the U.K. or Australia. And he's saying, I was the first one to make this comment. Or the first one out of this gang to have pubes got the first That's pubes. what he meant. Yeah, a lot I mean, meaning a bunch. I bet the, the lot of these kids in this truck, but I'm the first one with pubes. And that was by a guy named Schpling. <laughs> S-H, S-C-H Pling. Anyway, uh, let's go to the next one. Here's one. Yeah, this is great because it looks like, yeah, that's a good one. I like it. Simply says... Uh, Chicklets. Chicklets. Yeah. yeah that's, it's just a picture of chicklets next to me, and it looks like my teeth yeah. are chicklets. That's from Let's Smoke About It podcast. And uh, this is my favorite one. This is my favorite one right here. By Bob Haynes. It says, I might be called Red Red the Pimple Head today, but wait till I'm... And then it's a picture of a dog, and then the number nine in his crotch area. 
and I have a bit in my comedy where I talk about that's what I was called red on the head like a dick on a dog oh, yeah somebody's and, paying attention and they're paying attention and they used my comedy in the meme nice and I like that one shout out Bob Haynes I would say why is he using the number nine as the dog's penis you know you could have used a one, one. the letter I you know what I'm saying yeah. like a nine it, is it because they're crooked do they I don't know a lot about dog dicks but I don't <laughs> I don't think they're in the shape of nines Anyway, I like the effort. Um, and now I do have a, one last category I'm going to do, and this will be my least favorite one. And this is a comment and a meme by someone named Elliot. Can you put that up there, the Alan Jackson? Let's start with that. Oh so that was the picture that he put up, and he says, the inspiration for that scene in The Hitcher where Rudger Hauer is in the station wagon with the family he eventually kills. And then he made this meme. Okay. <laughs> a couple of things I don't understand. I love the effort. I don't understand it. Um, because the original picture, I am in a truck. I'm not hitchhiking. I'm not in a station wagon. Nor do I kill my family. Somehow, that's what you came up with. Please explain yourself, Elliot the Intern. That was just the first thing that I thought of when I saw your picture. It reminded me of that scene in the movie. Good enough. Ever try to go with your second or third thought? <laughs> <laughs> Next time. <laughs> so, you thought that was a station wagon that I was in? No, not at all. Just the back of a vehicle, period. Right. I, I, and I got to be honest, I don't really remember too much about the hitcher. Um, well, being that you're such a fan of 80s films, I thought yeah. that would be right up your alley. I do remember exactly. it a little bit, but I, that's not what popped in my... So what's with the teddy bear in the, the picture? Uh, he's, uh, uh, how do I say this, uh, uh, kind of um, cozying up to this family, and uh, C. Thomas Howell sees him oh, in the back yeah. of that, so C. he Thomas knows that Howell. he's dangerous, and so he's you know playing with the kid's uh, okay. teddy bear, and he knows that this disaster will ensue. Well, I didn't get it. And that's why it made my least favorite one. Oh. <laughs> had, had so you're on the board, buddy. Yeah. Oh, gee, you're thanks. on the podium. <laughs>